Um, so I'm just going to do a, a review on the NYX Slim Lip Pencils. And I've just got the five ones for you. Five pencils. Um, so I'll just talk you through um, you know, how they've been and that kind of stuff and where you can get them from. Um, so I was sent these for reviewing. Um, I picked out these five colours. Um, the first one I've got is called Natural, which looks like that. Um, I thought it would be more like a nude, but it's more on the pinky side. Then again, it would be different on my lips than to somebody else with a lighter skin, to skin tone to me. But that's natural. I have coffee, which looks like that. It's more of a brown type colour. Um, Dolly Pink, which is a bright Barbie pink type colour. It's a bit darker, but the camera's sort of washing it out a little bit. I have Purple Rain, which is a purple colour as you can see, it's like a fuchsia, fuchsia purpley colour. <laughs> and then I have Burgundy, which is a dark red colour. So I'll just swatch them for you. Um, this is natural. That's natural for you. Um, this is coffee. Coffee is just there. And then Dolly Pink. Now it, this comes off really like white looking but it's not. It's exactly, it's literally, it's true to colour but the camera is sort of washing out. It's like a, um, like a bluey pink type colour, it's like a ba you know, Barbie pink basically. Um, and then I have Purple Rain, which is that one. And Burgundy, which is that one. Right, so um, the lip pencils are really, like, really soft. They come off creamy on your lips, not too drying. Well, they're not drying at all, actually. They're very blendable. I find that I don't have to, like, um, apply so much for it to come off on my lips. It does, you know, the colour payoff is it's good for, you know, the price and stuff. Um, the only thing I will say that I don't like or isn't, a plus is the size of them you know compared to a MAC lip pencils which look like this this is the size of a, of a standard MAC lip pencils the next ones are kind of shorter but they do do longer lip pencils as well from NYX so it depends what you go for but I found that the slim lip pencils are a lot more um, they've got more of a range of colors than the longer ones so, um, apart from that, I would say the NYX pencils are really, really good. I find that I've been reaching for them a lot more than my um, MAC ones. <coughs> Sorry, excuse me. From my, uh, more than my, my MAC ones. And they retail at £3.95, which is a really good bargain. Especially if you're just starting out. If you don't normally use lip pencils or you want to try something that isn't as expensive as MAC or say you're, you're of a high-end product. So, um, I would definitely say, recommend you go get some. Um, sometimes it's difficult to um, know what a colour looks like from just looking at the website, but um, I, I really wish they had a store you could go to and actually swatch these colours. But um, obviously they, do, they don't do that in this country, in the UK. But um, just but go on YouTube and um, search for particular colour that you might want. Somebody might have already done a review on them or have swatches so you can easily, you know, find out what it, what it does look like in person. So yeah, the, the link to their website in the UK is below and obviously those in the US, you know where you can get your NYX products from. If you do decide to buy any products from NYX, um, when you get to the place where it says, how did you find out about us? Um, it would be helpful if you can put you know, that you were recommended by, you know, put my um, channel name in that, in the description bit, where you, yeah, in that bit, so it would help, you know, for them to know 
you know, who's been referred um, from my channel due to my reviews. So obviously I can get more reviews for you guys for products you might want to try out and you don't know about. So if you don't mind, just like put my, um, my channel name in that section. That would be really, really helpful. Um, so yeah. I think I've covered everything about the pencils. I do recommend them. Like I said, I've been reaching for them a lot more than my lip pencils. My MAC ones, I'm going to try and find, um, put together dupes for my MAC products with other, you know, drugstore or um, affordable products and stuff. So, you know, just look out for that video. So, um, um, yeah, look out for that video. I think I hope this was helpful to you. If you haven't tried the lip pencils or didn't know what they felt like um i recommend them definitely so yeah thanks for watching and i'll speak to you in my next video bye